solutions that, that our customers use to develop their products, uh, produce, uh, certify, optimize, and support support the products. And of course, we, we were born in aerospace and defense, and you know that is still one of our core businesses. Um, although we have diversified into you know eleven other industries. Uh, the um, you know when we look at what's happening right now with the industry, there there is still a significant investment in in transforming how aircraft and or defense systems are manufactured. Um, you know we're moving from an environment which was high, uh, you know you know high 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 degree of automation in fabrication and almost no automation in assembly. Um, <laughs> so as as the supply chains become more sophisticated. As the pressure on rate and rate scalability, you know, has gone up as well quite a bit, you know, our customers have been, um, you know, really focused on transforming their factories. And 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 when I say factory, you should really read, you know, production system, how how they source, how they produce, how they plan, how they schedule, um, and then you know all of the technology inside the plant to make you know. The, the 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 shop uh, much more efficient, much more productive, and, and more flexible in terms of the different products they can produce. Flexible in terms of the rate that they can produce it at, and um, and and you know those are the those are the key the key things that they're looking at. So what we're seeing is, you know, the implementation of a you know a, a digital infrastructure for the manufacturing process, and and it's that digital infrastructure that. Um,